<clears throat> okay. I've seen people play this game a long time ago and it's incredibly creepy. The whole version was released today, so I decided to play it. Welcome to We Happy Few. I'm gonna be a scrub and play on easy today. Act one, Arthur. Happy people have no past. Oh, that's just dark. Press the space bar to continue. Press E to sit down. <laughs> Dig on for victory over communism. <laughs> no swimming in the river. Oh, heavens no. Brothers win scrap gathering oh, prize. God. So that sounded really loud. Really loud indeed. I should just take my joy, shouldn't I? What? Hold E to remember, hold V to take joy. Uh... I gotta remember. Percy! Uh, I should have just taken the joy. What have you been up to? No one's seen you for hours. Ah, oh, nose to the grindstone, you know. Then why haven't I heard a single whoosh through the door since ten o'clock? Did you forget we're having Deirdre's birthday party? Oh. We've got a pinata. Right. Brilliant. Of course. Have you forgotten your joy? <laughs> of course not. Snug as a mug on a drug. Well, come on then. Finish up. Uh, just have a few more pages. Uh, I know What's going on, Luciana? Then don't take too long Welcome to, to We Happy Few. Did you take your joy today? I know I didn't. Aha. The power cell's empty. Well, what will you do? I'll get a new one. I gotta get that new power cell. There is now a curfew in effect at night. Any... Yes. One could read that without a ripple in one's teacup. How does she know? Well, I expect you in the conference room presently. Don't dawdle. You don't want to miss the pinata. Um, wasn't Prudence supposed to be coming back today? I made her a welcome back card. I, I, I don't know what I'm doing. Fond memories. <laughs> Employee of the month, achievement unlocked. I don't know what I did. I don't want to be here anymore either. Maybe I should take my meds. Yeah, I'm just I'm just gonna go.
Clive Earthwhistle. You're off at the party, aren't you? Uh, do I need anything in here? What's this say? Keep your chin up. I will. I did take them. No, no, leave me alone. I took my joy. I took my joy. No, no, leave me alone. No. Oh, oh, oh. to be a bit behind in our work now. Welcome, you know, Rewind you? King. Did you also take your joy today? That's cool. Right, what's going on in here? Conference room. There you are. You nearly missed the piñata. It's the most adorable Spanish custom. Uncle Jack did a whole show about it. Oh. You smash it until all the sweets come out. I don't think piñatas are supposed Come to make a squish sound, hit it. though. Hit it! Hit it! O okay, I'll hit it. Come on! Oh, why is it bleeding everywhere? Oh! Oh God! Oh God! You are off your joy. Take one of mine. Take the oh pill. Lord. He's a downer. Call security. We've got a downer. Take your joy. Take your joy. Yeah, I don't want it. I don't want the joy. Probably a bad time to ask for that raise. Oh god. Uh Well, gas. Flaming Nora. Forget him. There's no time. Happy is the country with no past. I don't know what just happened, but that was creepy. Good lord. <laughs> Generating world by planting foliage. Very nice. Furball, if you OD'd on your joy, you're going to be so incredibly happy that even math homework will be a pleasant pastime and you will learn to love it. I'm afraid it's too late for you. Christ, I thought of those bastards chased me. There were bridges, weren't there? And tunnels. I'm pretty sure I'm not in the parade anymore. I don't even think I'm still in the village. Did you remember to shave? Heart storage? Brush your teeth? Oh. I hope you did all these things, but they're not the most No. Pins. Coins. Craftings using the crafting menu. Okay. A proper suit. Jimmy bears. I don't know if I can make anything yet. What's this? More bobby pins. Not the math. I'll need some odds and bobs and bits of metal to make a lockpick. Make a lockpick, okay. Uh... Do I not know how to make a lockpick? Metal bit, oh, lockpick. Okay, I made there a lockpick, now what? Three years of the salamander and me getting into constant trouble finally pay off. Alright, well I opened that, but what's here? Hello? An empty pill bottle. I don't, 
I don't want to search the toilets. I, I definitely don't. I'm just gonna go this way now. What happened to him? Or rather, who? You see, Furball, this is what happens when you take too much joy. I got a dirty bandage. Excuse me, son. Fisty cuffs. Fist, fist. That's the first fight I've won since primary school. Eh, fisty cuffs, it is. Actually, I think it's the first fight I've been in since primary school. Press the button. Any other hatches to go to just yet? Okay, so I think I'm up and out. But where am I? The bridge. I've got to get to the bridge in the parade district, which I just got chased out of. Brilliant. Ah, the train station. If I can get to the train station, I can just follow the old rail tunnel all the way to the bridge. It'd be nice if there was a map, wouldn't it? Well, I suppose back in those days we could remember where things were. It's not cocaine, it's joy. If anything, it's liquefied acid. Is this a German bomb? Okay. I am coming for you, Percy. I haven't got it all figured out, but I will find you. It's, uh, very nice here. Oh, lovely, a tea party with, uh, the sailor. Uh, the random mannequin. And the cat. A rotten this carrot. Give me food poisoning. Can I have your hat? No, I want your hat. Okay, fine. No hat for me. Uh. Okay, what about this uh this random dude's home? What's in here? Hello. When will they stop crying? Uh, this game seems like Alice in Wonderland, but tripping on LSD. <laughs> I-I don't think you're far off, honestly. I think that's pretty accurate. Locked. Aha, uh -huh. but I remember how to make a lock pick. Duct tape. Perfect, I can use that to- ow. I can use that to tie up random people. Um, I am sorry to report that the girl Spoon wouldn't eat her porridge, so I sent her to bed without supper. The nanny. Nanny's tea party. Do come in your finery. Remember your manners. <laughs> A 
Jimmy Bear. Ooh. I need to make more lock picks. I can't make a lock pick. I need more bobby pins. God damn. I will. Haha. -ha. Now where am I going? Through the woods we go? This game is called We Happy Few. It was released, uh, fully released today on Steam. And it's 60 bucks. Oh, it's a dude. Uh, hello? Nice suit. Thank you. My uncle bought it for me last Christmas. Anxious to get back home to the village? Well, I... Uh, well, I live in the parade. <laughs> you won't get past that door. Not without one of them disposable electrical cars that all the bobbies have. And a power cell. Know where I could mug a bobby? <laughs> You're a brave one, aren't you? No. I'll trade you one. So you want to go back home? Home to all those bastards who chased me out of my house. When they all catch the plague and die, then I'll go back. There's something I want a whole lot more. Those bastards in that camp over there, with the helmets and the proper weapons. This guy is really angry. They took something from me. You get them back for me. I'll give you my card. Sounds quite dangerous, isn't it? Of course it's bloody dangerous. That's why I'm paying you. Come and find me in that sort of hamlet over there. We'll trade. All right. Well, what are they? Me medals. From the war. I won the DSO at Dunkirk and the Victoria Cross at Ramsgate. Those bastards. They thought it was funny that I still had them. Fucking funny they thought it was. No, oh, and you'll need a power cell to fire this thing up. Hooligan stole most of those too. Right. Well, I'll see what I can do. Well, off I go to a camp of robbers. Maybe I can defeat them with my rapier sharp wit. I guess they're probably over here. I do need to change the name of the stream. You're right. Let's see if I can do that. All right, I just changed. I changed the name of the stream. Should all be better now. No more black ops. Heaven's alive. It's a bloody fortress. And I look pretty well buttoned up. I suppose I can wait here till they throw a party for the whole neighborhood. I'll find a cleverer way in. Oh, I definitely got to find a cleverer way in. But I'm not I'm not that clever though, that's the issue. Oof. Alright. Maybe I gotta go this way. It's around the side. I'm looking for like a hole or something to crawl into. Oh, here we go. Another lock pick. Ah, bobby pins. Good. I can make lock picks now. Done. Picking the lock. What's going on, Sylvan the Hedgehog? Did you also take your joy today? If not, you probably should. It's secretly heroin. Sally would have loved this. If we could never get in here. Who's Sally? I guess I have to take that elevator. I hope no one notices. 
I have to take the elevator. Hopefully no one will notice. Yeah, that'll work great. Are, are we going? Oh. Uh, lovely day, Fred. A lovely day it is. Not many people get this far. It's sort of a test. Someone who gets this far usually puts up a decent fight. In the arena. I don't suppose there's some way I could be more useful to you alive. I don't know. Can you juggle? Well, I can write a lovely poem. I won a prize in school. Nah. We've already got a bad. First, put your things in that box. It will leave you there to starve. Gird thy loins for the moment of truth. For it is upon you. Where are we going? No! No! You bastards. Head boy rules. For little George's initiation, he has to one. Win in a Rita fight with a tourist. Two, fresh meat only. Steal food, not looted from a dead body. Three, sneak into the village and steal a bobby hat. Four, clean my jacket. Five, stop being a dull wanker. Oops, I guess little George might not be head boy material after all. Or a padded branch. That padded one doesn't look nearly as effective. How badly do I not want to kill good old Danny? Okay, guys, do I want to kill him or do I want to knock him out? I see kill him. Okay. And Danny's picked the lethal one. That's cheery. Hey, some guy. I've got great odds on you. Don't fuck it up. He's got to come on strong with that lead pipe. You've got to want to block that. Oh, hit me. Shoving it. 
that. Alright, we did it. I successfully murdered three people with a pointy stick. All because they didn't take their joy. Let's all wish him well on his journey. I've got a sinking feeling. Oh god, this shot. Oh god. Oh, human bodies. Hmm. Switch between weapons. Or can I? Uh, all of my weapons are horrible. Well, alright then. I gotta find my way to get out of this, uh, body dump. There's some sort of vent. I wonder if I can pry it loose. I just need a jimmy bar. Perfect. I suppose now that no one is actively trying to kill me, I ought to be on the lookout for a modeling dispenser. That chap. Completing quest throughout Wellington Wells will give me skill points. Sweet dreams quietly choke people unconscious from behind. <laughs> yep, I'm, I'm getting this one. Perfect. I suppose now that no one is, I better figure out how to get rid of him in a quiet life. I definitely don't want a crowd. Sorry. How to be sneaky? Never mind. Just take him down. They didn't they didn't hear anything. I wonder if I can choke this guy from behind. Ow! Bloody oh. hell! Wait, I don't even get to fight him? Uh Sweet dreams. <laughs> Wonderful. Prop them up in a building and let a doctor know. That was weird. Okay, glass bottle. Oh, 
Oh oh. Can I make another lockpick? No. Well, I guess we're going this way. Well, I think that's everything I had when they jumped me. Wait, I can't leave yet. I don't have the power cells for the bridge. All that chap's medals. Okay. Can I kill these guys? No, I don't know what I have to do here. I guess we're killing everybody. Now I gotta find this dude's war medals. I guess I'll go to that hamlet and give that chap his medals, and he'll give me the card I need to cross the bridge. Make a lock pick now? No. How do I get out of here then? No, I'm just confused. I guess I can go back this way. All right, freedom. Holding all these glass bottles, but I could disappear into those bushes. Enemies won't spot you if you're sneaking in one of the bushes with the yellow flowers. What's going on, Pyro? Playing some We Happy Few. fight all of you. A ton of gift cards. What kind of gift cards were you buying, my dude? you actually I don't even know who I just beat but whoever it was is in serious pain 
Give this guy back his medals. Alright, will do. Save a bit for the next minute. Wait, what's this? Oh. Well, that's terrifying. What else is this? Is this a dead body? Yes. Uh. Why are they running? It occurs to me that the locals may not be all that welcoming. Oh dear, let's try not to get killed, shall we? Hello? Uh... Hello? Anyone out there? What the hell? He has a cone on his head. Shit. Slumming it, are we? Must be nice to have a closet. Over here! Over here! Do you wanna get thrashed? Come in! Come in! Okay, I'm in. You're Jeez. Really, aren't you? From the parade. Yes. <laughs> well, I. How could you tell? <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you how to survive your next five minutes, and in return, you'll give me your socks. Well, that's outrageous. Your funeral. I just gave away my socks. What oh, the hell? So angry. Because that suit you're wearing reminds them of all the jolly, proper, decent wellies who drove them out of the homes in the village. And now we're all cold and tired and starving to death. You better get a nice sharp rock and rip that to shreds. My uncle gave this to me for Christmas. Or they'll rip you to shreds. Shit. I hadn't thought there would be so many. Yeah, it's like the latest groovy nightclub, isn't it? People get a bad batch of joy and it like flips a switch and they can't take joy anymore. So they get chased out of the village. Been a lot of bad batches lately. So what happens if I rip up my suit? They invite me over for tea and biscuits. Then they really won't give a damn what you do, so long as you don't take things that don't belong to you. Or go up and punch someone in the nose. Now Aww. you can survive the That's next how I do five things. minutes. Cheerio! I've received a rock. Uh... Craft a torn suit. Okay. How do I do that? Um. Torn suit, you say? Now, if I was Percy, I'd just go promenading about, wondering why everyone was staring. I never did quite grasp what's so important about wearing clothes. I don't know how to craft this. Maybe I actually have to go to this table. Use the workbench. Okay, let's try that. Torn suit. Done. Oh, I don't think my suit is decent anymore. I could wear it around. It's hard when you can't trust your own memory, isn't it? Oh, here he is. I got your medals. Thank you. You don't know what these mean to me. To know that some of us fought. To know that I fought. You're probably too young to remember. We stood tall in those days. In 42, we threw them back into sea. Then they came back in 43. It weren't the same. I hate to be a bother, but the card to get across the bridge? Right. Oh, of course, yeah. Sorry. Forgive an old man his memories. Well, good luck. I've got this key card, and I can power up the gate with the power cell. A safe. I suppose if there's something valuable in this house, it ought to be in here. A dig spot was added to my map. Yes, I am. NPCs of status base. Spoiling for a fight, are we? 
Wait, what? Ah! I don't have a weapon out there. You can't just call it a victory. A victory is when you win. Oof. They're all so pissed, but I don't have a weapon out. I know my fists are out, but I mean, jeez. My fists won't go back in. My fists are lethal weapons, I'm sorry. Oh, these guys are actually chasing me. Oh, God. That smells awful in here. How do I make my fists go away? I don't know. I don't know what I did, but okay. So I think I'm going to my point of departure. Or maybe I'm going yeah, right here. If I go through without taking my joy, I'm gonna get spanked. I don't run like hell when it lets me out. Oh dear. Uh oh. Well, that was lucky. One bridge down, and I'm off to the train station. Yeah, sure. Let's just not question why the robot exploded. Oh, what is this? Is this more heroin? This is where we hang them, isn't it? They broke into the police station, tried to burn the register so the Germans wouldn't know which kids to take. We didn't want the Germans to be angry, did we? We were so scared, or maybe just so tired. So we hanged them to encourage the others. I wonder if we'd made the Germans take the kids by force instead of bringing them down to the station singing London Bridge if things would be different now. <sighs> mm, delicious. I hope that's the worst thing I remember. Says the chap heading to the train station. Oh, what lovely memories are waiting for me there. Zero joy, zero percent memory loss. I'm thirsty, I'm hungry. At least I can get on the train well, tracks there and get super the hell out tired. of town. No, I just need to find the train station. I want to be able to see it from a distance. Travel to the train station. Alright, I'm on my way. I'm pretty close, too. This place is still completely destroyed, though. And here we are. Not quite as grand as it used to be. Of course, there hasn't been. Uh-oh. What are we going to do if there isn't food? Will you shut it? I'm trying not to blow myself up. Hey, look up your ball bags. I'll piss in your corpses. What the fuck? We're coming for you, you greedy bastard! No shot. Go eat a banger, you leaky scanner. You're done hoarding all the bee meat. 
I think he just blew himself up. He's got a club. How do I get down to the tracks? My butt. A dead body. Ah, oh, that. So I get down. Right. Huh. Now I just have to find the tracks and walk on out of Wellington Wells. List of names and dates. All right. Is there any med kits kicking around? I desperately need one. It does not look like it. Unfortunately. Do I got a flashlight or anything? It's hard to see. Okay, well, power's on. The question is, where am I going? Oh, med kit. Healing bomb. Nice. All right. So where am I going? I gotta flick these. Yep. Oh, and I'm missing C. So I gotta find a lever. But it's awful dark. Heart storage, maybe. I feel like what I'm looking for is in here somewhere. But I'm just blind and can't see it. A flashlight! When you need to see in the dark, you can equip the torch as long as the power cell lasts. Aha. Uh -huh. Not a very not a very good flashlight, mind you, but it will do. I guess. I don't want to search the toilets. There's not going to be one in there. Maybe it's in the desk lock. There's just scotch in there. Hey, Virgin. I'm doing pretty good. How about you? I'm just playing some We Happy Few. And I didn't take my joy, so now I'm a downer and everyone wants to kill me. Sure. Alright! I can get through the door. That didn't take too long. 
I don't have an infinite amount of lockpicks, game. Come on now. Yes, I have a lockpick. There we go. God oh, damn. Oh, I'm remembering stuff. What am I trying to do in this game? Not die. Oh, I think I'm, I'm looking so for sorry, my brother Maxie. or something. I should have got on the train with you, like I promised. The rule was if a kid was a day over 13, what could I do? You could have kept your mouth shut, Arthur, and not told them you were 13. That's what you could have done. Money! Random emails. Gotta love it. The door is jammed. Maybe if I just sit down, read the newspaper. Where did I even get the newspaper? Oh. Well, remembering stuff again. I promised I'd go with him. And you are too old to go to Germany, are you not? Please, no! You can't take care of yourself! Ooh. Bloody Bobby. I told him I wanted to board even if I was ten days too old, but we don't make the rules anymore, Mr. Hastings. I shouldn't have told him they got my birthday wrong. I don't even know why I did. I should have just kept quiet and got on the train. Bloody hell. There's been some sort of cave-in. So much for walking down the train tracks to the Britannia Bridge. What the fuck do I do now? Oh, look! Bloody hell. It's a little lost lamb. Where's Bo Peep? I got In a shovel, boys. In way, I bet. <laughs> That's little Miss Muppet, you Muppet. Uh, 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 can we pound him now? Yep. And don't come back. <laughs> That's right. What am I doing? I'm beating a bunch of people that just tried to murder me. That's what I'm doing. There we go. The shovel came in handy. Let's unlock the door with a trusty lockpick. Get the heck out of here. Flimsy cricket bat. Nothing. Damn. All right. There's some rats on the floor. Delicious. Another pipe. Can never have too many weapons. Never have too many weapons. Especially if you didn't take your joy. Oh, am I out? I think I have escaped the train station. What's going on here? Bloody hell. That's Ollie. Ollie! Come for me, have you? Ollie? I'm Arthur. You won't get me. You won't get me, you bastard. Ollie! No! 
It's Arthur! Bloody murdering wastrels! You've gone mental! I'll save you, Margaret! I'm your old neighbour, Artie! Always lying! Little Artie! Artie's gone! They took him away! Ollie, no! They You're didn't! You're lying! You're a wastrel! Ollie, it's Arthur! Well, why didn't you see that before? <laughs> Oh my god, Artie. Little Artie. Yeah, for fuck's sake. Watch your mouth, laddie. What would your mum think? I thought they took you away. No. They had my birthday wrong. What? Sorry. No, of course not. No, you've got it all wrong. That was Jack turned you in and I what tried to save you. Right. I remember now. You came back. From the station. The only one. You don't think they hurt him? Percy. The Germans aren't animals, you know. They just wanted to make sure we stay quiet. And we did. Spot of tea? Uh, that's very kind of you. I I'm not thirsty. What is that's going right, on here? Margaret. We have to run after water. <laughs> oh, God. I have to find him. Any idea where he might be after all these years? Not really. I know I have to get out of Wellington Wells. I, I thought I could take the train tracks to the bridge. Aye. The only way to the Britannia Bridge is the train station and the parade. And good luck getting into the parade. You could stay here. Remember when you and Sally used to stay with me? When the... But it's young Artie. Meg, you remember Artie, don't you? No room at the inn for young Artie? No. You're right. You're always right. Sorry. Margaret says it's best if I keep to myself. Oh. Sorry to bother. But... Margaret thinks we could help each other. Really? What the fuck is we, going on? There's a warehouse in the old German camp. We could burgle it. The Victory Memorial Camp? Where all those home army chaps run around practicing stabbing people with bayonets? What do you want me to do there? Run around yelling, here I am, shoot me, while you go in under the wire? There's uh, a thing I need from their warehouse. If you help me, I'll get you out of Wellington Wells. I just need you to turn off the power in the camp. And this isn't going to get me killed. Don't be a great girl's blouse. I'll meet you at the bunker after dark. Don't worry about the sentries on the bridge. I'll make sure they get a good night's sleep. Trust me. I know what I'm doing. I don't think he knows what he's doing. Shall I just show myself out then? Ollie! Okay, so what else do we have? Super duper. What's this? Un I can carry more. I can search bodies faster. I can talk to people. Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, I can do more damage from hitting people, but oh, you, you need that one. Cost five! Oh man, I have no points left. Thought I had three points. Oh, that sucks. I don't actually know the way out, you know! Well, that's how you get out. Now, is there anything in here I can steal before I gotta go? Some victory meat? That's Margaret. From school. Margaret... What's her name? She was supposed to go on the train, but then she disappeared and no one would talk about it. What's over here? Anything? Oh, I got a hammer. Oh, I can't pick it up. That sucks. Alright, let's get out of here. Keep doing our thing. Cross the bridge and meet Ollie. The Scottish play, 460 meters away. Alright. Man, I wonder what this place looks like when you have taken your joy. Stop the movie! Oh god, please stop it! At least we're alive. Right. I'd better not catch you getting into my stuff. Oh. Sorry. I should have just taken my joy. 
but instead I didn't. Oh man. Here's what I heard at the pub. A man walks into a doctor's office. He has a cucumber of his toes <laughs> and a carrot in his left ear and a banana in his right ear. That's a blimp. What's the matter with me? He asks the doctor. The doctor replies, "You're not eating properly." <laughs> this place is weird. I can't. I can't say anything other than this place is really weird. Oh, I'm getting old. All right. Now you two bloody listen to me, all right? One fine day, the sea boys come running into the regimental HQ. They so all drunk. No fucking civilians! I have to kill you now. Christ, I better not let anyone see me out of uniform. Can I take his gun? I guess not. I was hoping I could strip him and steal his uniform, but I guess I can't do that either. This is an awkward fortress. A very awkward fortress indeed. Bunker this way. Okay. Raw meat. Mm, delicious. Delicious! Can I get in this way? Yes. What am I doing? Yes. Get down from that tree before I chop it down. Do you know why they're registering us? The Germans love their lists, that's all. They're taking us away on a train to Germany. You know about it, don't you? Who told you that? It's ridiculous. Oh, oh you all know about it, just not the kids. Look, they've got cows there. They've got cows. Milk. They might even have chocolate. Oh, chocolate makes it all better. They've got tanks, Arthur. Why haven't you noticed? How are we supposed to argue with tanks? I don't want to go to Germany. It's only for a little while, I think. I don't want to be a hostage. Calm down. Let's have some tea. Oh, right. I'll, I'll come down. Um, I think I might be... Duck, actually. <laughs> okay. Let me in. Okay, so I guess I gotta keep up. I can go up. Look, Mum. No hands. Do you ever wonder why the Germans didn't take their tanks with them when they left? I've made a map. There's a hole in the fence, inside the dump. You just have to get in here, get the key, and cut the power. Then, sneak out into the darkness while I rob them blind. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. How do I cut the power? The General keeps the keys in his desk. You want me to break into the General's office? Any way you can scotch the power is fine by me, lad. I'll meet you back at the train station. What if they spot me? I'd run. They don't have a lot of ammunition, but they're terribly handy with their bayonets. That's your plan B? Run? Well, you could ask them for some of their famous hot buttered crumpets, but I wouldn't recommend it. They can't run very fast. They're all <laughs> old farts, like me. Good old crumpets. That is always the answer in a British game. Just ask for crumpets. Let's see that. 
Two bags of sugar, fire, water, etc. Only sleeping potion for those chaps on the bridge. All right. Ollie said there was a hole in the fence in the dump. That sounds much safer than walking in by the front gate. Is it this? Well, this is the dump, right? I thought that was the dump. Maybe not. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Band of brothers enter the dump. Alright, where are we? Okay, so the dump is just over here somewhere. I guess. So I'll just head this way and hope for the best. I don't think the dump was this way. Attention all personnel, please remember to boil all water. The distillery. Yeah. Well. Uh. I mean, we may as well steal some moonshine. But yeah, this definitely wasn't the way to go. I suppose I'm supposed to go back this way. Bunker. I saw a dude walking out here at one point. I wonder where he went. <laughs> oh. Well, he's blind. Good for me. So maybe the dump is this way. I don't think it's this way either. I'm really bad at reading a map, I guess. Which is fair enough. So there's no dumping, but I mean, come on now. This has to be the dump. It is the dump. I was right the whole time, but where's this hole? Is it like around here? I mean... Do I have any lockpicks, maybe?
Cool. The whole reason I was in this menu was to look for lockpicks. No. I'm telling you, there's no hole in the fence. I'm not seeing any hole in the fence. Oh boy. What the heck is that? Looks like the Illuminati. Huh. Uh. Okay. There is no hole here. I'm giving up. I am giving up. If you see a hole, someone let me know. <laughs> okay, where's my... If I go to three... Hole in the fence near the dump. Okay, well, I'm gonna go to this side of the rock. And maybe this so called hole's over here somewhere. No. Okay, try the other side. Oh, I figured I'd be able to lockpick this, but no. I think this game's BSing me. There is no hole in the fence. There's no way. Unless it's like over here. Okay. This looks more promising. Let's try over here. Still not seeing any hole. Follow the fence line, I guess. Just lie down. Excuse me, good sir. I require you for a moment. Perfect. No one will ever know. So yeah, I'm coming to the conclusion that there is definitely no hole in this fence that I can sneak through.
as I have looked up and down this fence and I have not found a hole. Other than this door. Don't mind me. Just having a bit of a sit down. Where I can seal. Well, uh, through the front door? I mean, horrible idea, and I know it. But, uh. Or maybe there's another dump? I don't know. I'm just going to start running around the entire outskirts of this place. Ooh. Don't want to get caught by them. They saw me, but they didn't do anything about it, which is good. Oh god. Alright, well, this is a bog. Oh! Howard Stools. He has mushrooms growing out of him. What a way to go. Highly contagious. Distillery. <laughs> so I'm here again. Which I mean, okay, sure. I'm about 10 seconds from actually just trying to raid my way through the front door. Okay, did I leave anything in here? No. Well, there's nothing out here. I'm just supposed to enter the dump, which the dump is literally right here. I'm not seeing any holes. Alright, screw it. I'll probably die. But, uh, for the sake of moving things along. We're fighting our way through the front door. See you later, man. Thanks for coming out. Come back for another beating. Oh, uh, bayonets. Attention, all patrols. Patrols should be particularly careful. Now we see the violence inherent in the system. Usual number of plague victims have been spotted there recently. Oh, I can't even get through the front gate. 
With my mighty shovel, I have nothing to fear. This is all because there's no actual hole in the fence of the dump. Like, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to go through here. But it doesn't give me the option for a lockpick. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this area entirely and go back and look for a bobby pin somewhere to open that door. Oh boy, a swing. So there's probably something here. Requires a lockpick. God damn it. Is there actually... Nothing here. Why does everything require a lockpick? All right. I'm just gonna have to start raiding these houses Shit. then for lockpicks. Or bobby pins to make said lockpicks. I'm really sorry this is taking so long. Doesn't really give you too much help on what to do. Oh, what's this? Another secret? Uncle Henry. When is Uncle Henry coming back? I don't know. But we surrendered. We did. Look, Dad won't talk about it. Maybe they drafted him. Can they do that? Who's going to stop them? I can't hear you. The Germans can do whatever they want until someone stops them. The Russians, for example. So why... So... So, so when is he... So when is he coming back? Oh, I don't know, Percy. I don't know. The Germans, they don't explain things. They just give orders. Why? Well, because... Because I don't know why, I'm sort of worried that he might have volunteered. I don't understand. It's probably for the best. Oh man. It's dark. Well, here's a house. Can I get in? Jammed. Of course! I just need bobby pins, man. That's it. Going to run bases. All I need is bobby pins. My life for a bobby pin. I feel like murdering a guy. What the fuck was that? What? What did you say to me? Hmm. Maybe I should sit down for a bit. 
Bloody hell. Oh, bloody hell. I can't believe I'm doing this. Well, I'm dying. That's a that's definitely a fact. Uh -huh. As I look for bobby bins. I should have just taken the damn joy. Should have just taken the damn joy. Then everything would have been fine. Uh-oh. Hardcore parkour. Is this like a mailbox or something? Can I get I stuff out of this? Might be the one Sally and they tried to blow up. No. Nope. I always wonder what happened to the letters. There was an awful lot of smoke. <laughs> well, it doesn't kill you. <laughs> well, this is an interesting looking place. Let's go up in here. Police line. Looking to return to the village, are you, sir? That's right. I've realized it was a mistake not to take my joy, and I'd like to rejoin civilization. Well, sir, you have come to the opposite place, but I'm afraid it is not the opposite time. The door goes in and out of operation at the moment. It's out. Should I wait? Not unless you're getting paid by the week like I am, sir. Oh, honestly, sir. It was open for a bit just a little while ago. But before that, it might have been days when it was closed. Mechanical things. I ain't holding up like they used to. Oh. I at least get some bobby pins. Oh. How'd you go home at night? Ah, well, me? I'll just use the maintenance hatch. Can I use the maintenance hatch? Oh, oh, that's only for bridge workers and bobbies. I'm afraid you'll have to wait for the regular door. Lovely. A big splinter. What? Well, at this point, I'm just running around aimlessly because I have no idea. I know where I think I need to go, but I don't have any lockpicks to do it. So, I need bobby pins to make lockpicks. Okay, here's an old rundown shack. Bobby pins, maybe? Nope, nothing at all. Nothing at all. More flowers. I don't know what any of this is used for, but why not? Grab a little bit of it here and there, and maybe when I do need it at some point. I'll have a good amount. I can't keep doing this. I'm having to backtrack so far. <laughs> this is insane. Jesus. Oh my god. Hmm. 
A water pump. Nice. There's a few more in the garden district, aren't there? Well, to fill up a canteen or two, shouldn't I? Cool. I found a water pump. I think I have a container. It's to be pretty clean, unlike in the village where they spike it with joy. Well, this is a creepy ass house. There's probably something in here. Oh, I've been here. A crib. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. When was the last time there was a baby in Wellington Wells? Dig spot discovered. What are these dig spots? Water, a camp, a dig spot, and a workbench. Oof. All I really care about right now is finding a bobby pin. Don't get me wrong, I love wandering aimlessly through nothing, but still. Place yourself, Arthur. There's feathers in the rubble. Hey, what's going on, Zero? Yeah, it's a good game, but I've been wandering aimlessly for God knows how long, trying to find a bobby pin to make a lockpick. Well, and I don't, e I, I don't even know if I need the lockpick. It's the down, the downside. Sort of secret message. Man, I hate I hate this so much right now. I'm getting old. I'm over a kilometer away from where I need to be. What's better, you changed your name back? A post, is there anything in here? No. Ah! <laughs> Spooky tea party, did I leave anything here? No. Okay. Oh. I wish I kept in shape. Oof. I know, it is the most important item. And it's the one thing I don't have. Uh <laughs> Dirty bandages. Oh, 
I remember what we did. I don't. I remember. Oh god, I remember. A lockpick! Ah! Hell, I don't need the bobby pin if I got a lockpick. So creepy. Cleaning my pews instead. I'm getting out of here. This place is weird. Now I gotta run 800 meters back to where I was and hope this lockpick works. Oh boy. A vending machine. Nice to see you. Sewing kit, alcohol, bandages. Huh. Maybe I should sit down for a bit. No, run. No sitting down. I did think I used to run the hundred meters. Why would you want to live in like the Adams family zone? Sounds terrifying. I don't really want to get in any other fights right now either because I'm really low on health. Church services was added to my journal. Oh no. I don't know what's in here, but I want to know. This music is weird. Lord, why are there cables coming out of that painting? Why does that bookshelf look like it doesn't quite fit? I think it needs power. Where can I turn on the power? What the fuck? Choose a symbol for each button. Check with the lever. If you get it wrong three times, the puzzle resets. I don't really want to, like, force my way all the way in here. Unless I find another lockpick. Yeah, oh, gas mask. Why not? Yeah, there's no other lockpick. I gotta keep on going. This is not what I expected the future to be. Powers the door? Wow, I got three of them right, only one was wrong. Uh, 
let's never talk about that incredible luck again. <laughs> Enter the shelter. It says do not open though. All right, I'm going in. Seen one of those in a while. What the hell? A pointy stick blueprint. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what this is. Oh, fast track. Got it. Another rusty shovel. Awesome. Rotating the wheel. Hey, we got power. Good. Now I can come back here with the minimum of fuss. Cool. So it's like a teleport. That's pretty neat. Well, I didn't expect to find that, but that's pretty cool. Now, back to the original task at hand. Save a bit for the next minute. We're actually not too far away, so... I should be back at that door momentarily. Once I break through this military outpost right here again. Now, if you miss this part of the stream, pretty much everybody in this military base has no bullets, but they're all really good with their bayonets. So, they're kind of useless. So I am back here again. In ye old Yeah, I figured. So I needed a lockpick. Oh god, they're here. What if they never come back? Stay for it. You change with Tommy. Harry, you change with Reg. <laughs> I never get tired of that joke. Day, sir. Alright. I know what I have to do here. So if I switch to I three. One of them at Ramsgate. Well, I'm pretty sure I did. Oops. I think someone pinched him. What's that? Who's on guard duty? There's a Fuck. mole. In the Who's hole. there? Grenade! Well, grenade? Ugh. <laughs> it started. It's finally stuck. They're bombing us again. Stop throwing grenades. Ow. I think I'm gonna die. I'll take you with me, damn it. Been... 
I'm taking you with me. on holiday <laughs> so when they murder you you just go on holiday for a bit how did I get back here oh uh. Well then, that didn't really cause too much of an issue. I went back like 50 feet. Unless I can't get through this door again. Oh. Alright, good. Aries, they grow all over the Golden District, don't they? I guess I can eat these till I run across a pub. <laughs> All right, let's try to stop cracking your damn knuckles. It's supposed to itch. Plans to voice contact with the enemy, you know. Who goes there? No one, don't worry about it. What's that? I'm just taking your darts. God damn it. Hit the dirt! Come back through to the pussy! I gotta find this so called hole. Go back to Germany, you swine! Oof. They're bombing us again! Are we doing this to each other? Can't we just agree to disagree? Nope. I just got a Lee Enfield rifle? I did. Well. <laughs> That's awesome. I am very seriously hurt now, though. Find a way into the camp, but I'm dying. Can't you see? I'm dying bad. Oh. 
Well. I made it this far. So come on. Oh, I get it. I see. <gasps> Gotta do some hardcore parkour. All right. Here goes. Fake tanks. <laughs> to the train station. We sent them off to Germany because of papier-mâché. The hell is papier-mâché? Paper-mâché? <laughs> I mean, that is some pretty good papier-mâché, though. Let's be real. Gotta be like Metal Gear Solid here. I saw this, and I figured I needed it. Oh, I can't go, Percy. I feel terrible. I keep wanting to throw up, but I never quite can. But we're supposed to tell. But we're supposed to tell. We're supposed to tell the scouts about the plants across the river. Actually, you're supposed to tell the scouts. Well, I know sagely. I can't hear you. You're not sick, Percy. Just go and tell the scouts about the plants. I can't talk to them. Do you think they're going to be nasty to you without me? No. Well, I'm vomiting. I want to make my brother some tea. Are you going to just not show up? All right, look, I'll phone them. Just remember to turn the flame off this time. All right? Okay. Sure. No. Uh, just rest in the feet. Yeah, it's perfect timing. Barrels now. Oh. Wait, where did both of them come from? Where did three of them come from? I said the key was in General Bing's office. No one, don't worry about it. Attention, all personnel. Some of the latrines are in the process of 
Okay, so we broke into this guy's office. And he's absolutely not in his desk. Why doesn't that surprise me? There's something behind this bookcase, isn't there? I feel positive there's something that could open this. Note, chord, note. What a jolly tune. Maybe I should play it. Okay. Maybe I should have a read and play it. Well, I like clever clogs. A hatch. If it leads underground like the others, I can use it to get out of here once I'm done. That's how I escape, is it? Okay. And, oh, first aid kit. Thank you. Let's, uh, take myself away from no health. Perfect! here just us squirrels Who's on guard duty? There's a mole. Shit. Attention all personnel there is an intruder in the camp all no. personnel report to your counter infiltration stations this is not a drill I'm not here All right. I don't remember at location. What? I love this game. It's an interesting game. I'm not here. Go away. Attention all personnel. The Merry Band players will be performing their brilliant play, Happy Hamlet, at 8 p.m. in the mess hall. All are invited. Don't worry. In Happy Hamlet, no one dies. Alright, time to turn all the power off. What? Alright, here goes. And out the back door. Oh, for fuck's sake, Ollie. He knew it was a law, didn't he? I bet he bloody knew. How do I get out of here? I'm not going to be able to jump over the fence from this side. I've got to get back to the general secret hatch. That's my way out. Yes, it is. Oh. It's 
so depressing, though. I mean, the game is literally about drugs. General secret hatch. Goodbye. Ha <laughs> I'm out of here. Papier mache tanks. Newspaper and fucking glue. Right. Now, if I can make it back to Ollie alive, he'll help me get out of town. Assuming that wasn't another lie. That won't be an awkward conversation at all, will it? You wanna fight? I got a bayonet too, boy. That's right. Don't mess with me. Knocking down my blocks in kindergarten. Where am I right now? So I'm in the mission where I gotta like break into the military base and try to like help Ollie steal something. Which I just did. So now I'm trying to get back to Ollie. Attention all personnel. Please remember to boil all water. Oh, he's back there. Okay. I wonder if these guys are still like drunk as all heck. Yep. Having a good old time. All right, down the road we go. Uh, the actual game is out now. Like, it got released officially today. So this is not the demo. I should have just taken my joy, man. Jesus. I wouldn't have oh to deal God. with any of this. But I didn't take my joy. And now I'm doing some Metal Gear Solid stuff. Probably come in the way I got out in the back of the station. My god, they've kidnapped some poor woman. I could be a real hero and rescue her, or get myself killed. Young Artie! Come on up! All right. I love how this guy just commandeered like an entire church for himself and turned it into a fortress. Alright, where is this guy? Is he over here? Huh? Do I gotta go up again? Alright, he's way up here. And in we go. That's a fair bit of Christmas there, isn't it? Did you know the power switch was alarmed? They're all quite mad, you know. Sometimes I think they want the Germans to come back. Did you know the power switch was alarmed? It's a shame of it, you see. They want another go. You I do you. like the game. It's pretty good so How far. How would I have known that? For fuck's sake, Artie. Times are hard, but you and I go back a ways. The tanks were hollow, Ollie. What's that? It's tank armor. The tanks, they're made of papier mache. We could have fought them if they didn't really have tanks. No, I wouldn't have given them Percy and the others. Oh, it up. I wouldn't have had to lie my way off that train. Oh my God. I lied my way off that train. I wasn't too old to go. You don't forget a thing like that. Didn't you hear me? I convinced the Germans they had my birthday wrong. If it was only me, I'd just take my happy pills and sleep through the end of the world. But I promised. I promised Percy I'd keep him safe while we were in Germany. 
You promised to help me get to the bridge. <laughs> the one in the parade on Apple Home? How would you even get to it? You can't even go to Maiden Home. They shut that bridge down last week. No. You're right. You're always right. Ever seen one of these? What does it do? Have at the foggiest. <laughs> but supposing you took this to the bridge to Maiden Home, and supposing you told the Bobbies you were there to fix the bridge works, it might uh, enhance your credibility. And from Maiden Home, I can get to Apple Home. And Apple Home has the only bridge out of Wellington Wells. See? <laughs> Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Well then, see you on the other side. I'd rather doubt that. <laughs> Adieu, Artie. Good luck. Thanks, buddy. For your... Toys R Us... thing. Alright, is there anything up here I can steal? It seems the thing I need most in this game is lockpicks, so... All right, I got seven skill points now. Let's get the chop. And put a little bit into this. Oh, no, can't. Is there nothing up here I can steal? Oh, man. Well, then. I guess we'll just continue on our merry way. Developer cheats. I don't need cheats. Not in this game. How did I get in here in the first place? Where's the exit? Uh. Ah. Huh. Right here. So I gotta go to the area called Oh Behave. Place yourself, Arthur. Am I in vigilante mode? Hell no. I'm in easy mode. It's my first time playing it, I'd never go into the hardest fishing. mode right out of the gate. We were witty in those days. I'm just in this one for the story. And beating people with a shovel, which is also very fun. We'll laugh about this later. All right. I can't keep doing this. Almost there. Bloody hell! Oh, bloody hell! day for it. Unfortunately, the bridge is not open at this time. It was working just a minute ago, but the door is broken again. You'll have to wait until it's up again. Do you ever let anybody in? Oh, yes. There's someone in there now. And in the past month? Well, in the past month. Ah, oh, there's a chap in there right now. You don't really want anyone back from the Garden District, do you? Well, my wastrel friend. No one goes off their joy can actually take joy. I mean, would you? Everybody feels better if that door stays broken. You, us, everybody. Well, Constable Wright, I suppose now I can tell Central why the bridge keeps breaking down. Central? Ever seen one of these? Oh, bugger me. You're not some sort of undercover bridge inspector. This device detects structural irregularities using shortwave radar. But I don't think it will show me the real problem. Will it, Constable Wright? 
Look, sir, you can fix that door, but <laughs> vigilante mode and die immediately. That joy. Yeah, it sounds it like veteran in Call of Duty or something. Everywhere. That's not for you to decide, is it? No, sir. The, the, the maintenance hatch is that way, sir. I, I, I'd be grateful if you forgot this conversation ever, ever happened. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Oh, Perfect. bugger. If I really was from Central, I'd have the card, wouldn't I? There is another way, though, isn't there? Is there? Please take a number and sit down. There's nobody else here. Please take a number and sit down. Okay. I'm number two. Don't mind me. Just having a bit of a sit down. Am I supposed to actually, like, sit here reading the newspaper for a bit? Number two. Now uh, serving that's, that's number me. two. Welcome to the rehabilitation center. Actually, I'm just a sort of undercover bridge inspector from Central. See this device? Uh, it detects structural... It... Then you should have no trouble passing the test, should you? Please head through the door there and begin uh -oh. your rehabilitation. Test. I didn't study. I, I didn't study. Oh, man. What the hell? Please deposit your personal belongings into this box, retaining only your clothes. Please continue okay. to the decontamination room. Okay. Please discard your clothes. What the hell? Don't worry, you will be provided with new, proper clothes after decontamination. Now I'm naked. Oh god. Not the water. Um. Stop, stop singing. Stop, please. Congratulations! You have been decontaminated. Yay. Please proceed to the next room and obtain fresh, new, proper, clean clothes. Okay. Oh, she's not watching. I'm judging. Ooh. In case in there time. is any residual odor of the garden district on you, please enjoy this refreshing scent of country flowers. Oh, what? what? Oh, no. It's like the perfume is department. Uh, licorice. Why uh, licorice? Get ready for the most important uh, moment in your rehabilitation. Let me out. Please take your favorite flavor out. of joy. Vanilla, chocolate, or strawberry. Oh, I must insist that you not traverse the beams of the joy detector without taking your joy, sir. Oh. Oh, damn it. They were serious about taking my joy, weren't they? Oops. Oh, go oh God. Different cut, different flavors of joy. The mood booth. I don't like I don't want strawberry, no. Joy makes you happy, but take care and take too much. 
The joy meter will help you track your joy experimentation. If the joy meter fills, you'll overdose and suffer penalties to combat. As you take more joy, you know, does memory loss counter? Oh man! This is a choice! Hey! Please head into the theater and take a seat. Okay. Look at this dude. Excellent. Sit tight and enjoy the show. Oh, okay. An etiquette minute. And now it's time for the Uncle Jack etiquette minute. You may be wondering, how can I fit in better in Hamlin Village? Well, it's easy. To get along, go along. If someone tells you it's a lovely day, agree with them. <laughs> because of course, it's always a lovely day in Hamlin Village. So don't be afraid of talking to people first. They'll appreciate it. Now, I'm assuming, of course, that you're decently dressed. Huh? Clothes make the man, eh? Indeed, naked people have almost no influence at all in society. <laughs> and don't dress in rags either, or people might think you're a wastrel. Now, what should you do if people are staring at you? Maybe they're asking you if you remember to take your joy. Who cares? Just pop another and they'll congratulate you and go on about their day. And if things seem to be getting a bit hectic, remember, you can always sit on a bench, relax and open the Hamlin or Quran. Take a load off. No one will bother you when you're sitting on a bench. Unless you've made them very angry. Well, <laughs> or... I don't know. Watch Jack Worthing on television. I, he's very good. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm afraid we've come to the end of our time. Tune in tomorrow for another Etiquette Minute with Jack Worthing. Let's move. Isn't Uncle Jack wonderful? He is. Now, please proceed to the Yay. third floor, where you will be tested on what you've just relearned. Okay. Life is great. Just a friendly reminder. Uncle Jack don't mention it, but a word to the wise. Proper decent people don't like people what is running, jumping, crouching, spying, sneaking, breaking or entering. Such like behaviours is what we associate with downers. Avoid them and we shan't have disagreements. Obviously, A. You gotta say hello. Yes, that's right. It never hurts to say hello to people. Hey! Player two, I'm afraid the eyes, the eyes, was not the right answer. Ha <laughs> ha. What would you like to know? If you realize you're wearing rags, should you? A. Pop a joy. B. Clothes for God's sake, and why not pop a joy? See, what does everything have eyes? Uh, clothes plus joy. You keep seeing Constable. eyes, my dude. Constable, Constable, your question. Right. Your well, here's my interrogative. If I see you running, jumping about, or crouching in the shadows, what will I likely do? A. 
tell you to stop your rotten shenanigans before I smash you in the face. Me. Whoa. Run and jump and play myself. See. Oh god, the eyes. The eyes? Well, I like the word shenanigans, so I'm gonna have to say A. But I think I think the answer is the eyes, honestly. Oh, it's a, it's a good thing I guessed. But what about the eyes? Did you say the eyes again, man? Like, I thought I think you're right. If you want to make friends with me, should you A, give me flowers, B, talk about old times, C, stop staring at me, why is everything staring? Uh... Uh, flowers, I guess? I don't really know. Again, I think it's staring. Oh. Hey, what do you pick, man? It looks like the eyes have you both, as they say. How disappointing. Now stop picking the eyes. Remember, doctors are here to help you. Who is this? If you've forgotten your joy, doctors will smell it right away. And they'll give you a quick injection to make your day a lovely one. Dr. Byron, what is your question? What happens when you take too much joy? can't find your own house. B. Who cares? C. Please, God, make them stop staring. Uh. Who cares, man? There's no such thing as too much joy. Drugs are for the awesome people. That's right. Player one. It hardly matters. You might lose a few hours, but sooner or later, you'll find yourself on a bench. No worse for the wear. Hey, oh, I did it. Oh, for heaven's sake, I'm not going to do this again. How do I get out of here? I already did are it. Are you ready to behave? No. No. Oh. Five guest questioners are going to ask you oh, one God. question each. All you have to do is show us that you understand how to behave yourself in Wellington World. Mr. Crashiel, what question do you have for our party son or daughter? If you want to fit in, you should. A. Say hello to everyone you meet, like what you do. B. Visit people's houses, whether they're there or not. C. The eyes! The eyes! The eyes! Okay, I think I'm... I'm good. I think I'm out. May I express my delight that you passed the examination, sir? We've not had as many as we'd hoped, sir. Not as many at all. And yet, they say the unexamined life is not worth living. Well, sir. He forces you to back. take joy. Oh, and in case your rustication... Has yeah, I watched him stab someone earlier. Please bear in mind, there is now a nocturnal curfew. Best be indoors after nightfall, sir. Okay, thank you. What was that? I saw an eye. Oh! Isn't this wonderful? Yeah, thank you. Remember the last time you up soon, I imagine. Hello, hello, hello. Civilization. There you are. Fancy a cuppa? Lovely day for it. You flirt. Hey. Couldn't be better, thanks. Lovely day for it. Lovely weather. Great. I forgot to tell you the punchline. 
So from here, I've got to get to St. George's home and then into the parade. And this place looks amazing. Transit to get into the parade, like the one I left on my desk in the parade. How do I get a new one? Lovely. Wait. The old government printing office was on Maidenhall. Maybe I can break in and steal some. Hello, sir. Lovely day for it. You're looking nice and trim. Cocaine. That's what Joy is made out of. All right. You know, I think we wear the same size. Hey, that's cool. Oh, man. Everything is so fantastic. Hey, what are you doing? Everything's coming up, Roses. I'm going to take Banzai lessons. That's you awesome. Come too. Nah. Maybe next time. Man, everything in this place is just so fantastic. Oh, look, a guy left his car. Looks like the old printing office is pretty well buttoned up. I wonder if there's a way in the back. I'm going in through the front. You know what? Never mind. Next week? Arthur? Arthur Hastings! Lovely day for it. Don't you lovely day for it, me, you idiot? It's me! Sally! Oh, I knew it was you. I mean, the glasses, the hair, the really adorable jacket. Don't ask me how. You're not that awkward little boy anymore, are you? But the way you walk, it's, it's like the mask isn't even there. I just, I just knew. There's Arthur. Sally? You look fantastic. This ancient thing. I've had it two weeks. I'm out of my mind with boredom. Green and white checked. Your dress, the last time I saw you. Running out the door. <laughs> that horrible gingham dress. God, that takes you back. <sighs> You're off your joy. Oh, don't be ridiculous. Oh, you have little fucking faith. I'm not going to turn you in. Whatever possesses you to go off your joy? <sighs> Percy. Oh, God. I saw a picture of him. I promised I'd look after him in Germany. I have to go and find him. How are you going to get out? Do we even have a letter of transit? Absolutely. On my desk in the city. <laughs> Good Christ. Just tell the policeman that. I'm sure they'll wave your right on through. Yeah, haven't figured that bit out yet. I'm very close with General Bing. Of course you are. <laughs> no. You always did have a knack for making helpful new friends. I mean, I could go see him and ask him to give you a letter of transit. Don't put the General out on my account. I'm sure you've only so many favours you can ask of him. My God. You still hate me, don't you? Yeah, well, I've only been wondering for the past 14 years. We were 16! How could you? Because I liked him. Some deep stuff going because on. Because he had that adorable beard. I don't know, there isn't a reason for everything. You're the last bloody person who should be off his joy. I can't believe you are. Believe me. Take enough... stuff. Look. Some... Downer broke into my lab last week. Literally tore the bars off the windows and the ridiculous thing is I forgot to lock the front door. The point is, it's a horrible, terrible world out there. I just don't see you smashing your way into the city without a great deal of help. Oh no, not me. I'm living on the King's Road right now. Of course you are. I couldn't exactly have stayed there, could I? Like nothing happened. This is getting deep. Look, I'm sorry. This isn't what I meant to... Maybe we could help each other. Maybe I could come by when I'm feeling... Better. Oh. Brilliant. Well then. You ass. How about going to the King's Road, knocking on her door and apologising grievously? And asking nicely for a letter of transit. She knows General Bing. Damn it, lad. She's Scarper. Oh. But what have we here? A friend of Miss Boyle's, innit? Funny. You don't seem all high and mighty. Perhaps we can express our feelings about Miss Boyle to her friend. Oh. I know it was you. Oh. <laughs> Got 
you. Oof. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's more than one. We just want to make you feel better. Now, now, what's all the scuffle? You've been having an altercation in the alley? Uh, nothing you need to worry about, Constable. I'll, uh, just be on my way. And where is it you're on your way to? Precisely. Just off to see an old friend on St. George. Oh, well, no need to be in such a hurry. The bridge to St. George is, uh, under renovations. Oh, for how long? I hesitate to prognosticate, sir. Dr. Faraday's the only one who knows how to fix the uh, ridiculous contraptions on them bridges. Word has been sent, but we've not had the courtesy of a reply. Why don't you, uh, I don't know, uh, go to Dr. Faraday's house? Because Dr. F has removed to a secret location, the, uh, location which headquarters keeps, uh, uh secret. All right. I'll ask your headquarters then. You some kind of troublemaker. Stay out of city business. I suppose if I want to go and make up with Sally, I need to get Dr. Faraday to come fix his bridge. <laughs> so I need to visit police headquarters and find out where he's gone. Not risky at all. It's always a little extra complicated with Sally, isn't it? The entire town is after me. <laughs> they did What's it. That? I know they did. He did it. I know he did. I'm dying from wounds. What's going on, Toon Army? How are you today? Did you take your joy? I am so dead. Oh. I didn't do it. No. I'm sorry. Go down fighting. I took him with me. In my feet. It's like nothing ever happened. And now everything's great again. Woohoo! Oh boy. This game. What is this place? What's this thing? Can I eat it? No. Oh, can't go that way. Couldn't be better, thanks. Did you hear? This is Sapper Fad of Bobbin and Gold. Should clear up soon, I imagine. I got a new compliment machine. It's so clever. A new compliment machine? What the hell? All right. Oh, we're here again. Looks like the old printing office is pretty well buttoned up. I wonder if there's a way in the back. All right. Maybe I can skip this. You know what? 
Never mind. Next week? Arthur? Arthur Hastings! Lovely day for it. You ass. How about going to the King's Road? Damn it, lads! <laughs> Look at him. He's covered in blood. <laughs> Nah, nah, what's all the scuffle? I suppose if I want to go and make up with Sally, I need to get Dr. Faraday to come fix his bridge. Alright. So I need to visit police headquarters and find out where he's gone. Worked that Don't time. Risky at all. It's always a little extra complicated with Sally, isn't it? Hello, Lovely sir. Lovely day for it. Did you hear about Constable Rossetti's wife's cake? No. What's going on with the constable's cake? Lovely day for it. Did you hear about Constable Rossetti's wife's cake? A joy detector. Well, I'd better take my joy. I already did. I'm running out of joy, though. I need some more. Hmm. Maybe this thing up here has some. Now that'd be a police box. Look what jolly good. Is there any joy in there? Oh, it looks like there might be some here. But I can't go in any of these places. Why? Well, here we go. This looks like a joy booth. Mmm, delicious. I'm now feeling happy again. All right. I saw a spanker spanker downer just now. It was so jolly. What? I saw a spanker spanker downer just now. Man, this is this place is weird. What's going on in here? Countrymen, lend me your ears. Don't you see that our world has gone mad? We're all in the same let's pretend game. We call a rat a cat. And we pretend our shopkeepers are coming back from holiday. And we don't talk about the most important event in our lives. And that is the gates on the bridges. Do you remember when they went back up? I don't. None of us do. But there haven't always been gates, have there? We took down the German gates at the victory. I know, because I walked from eel pie to apple home then. And weren't my feet sore, eh? Get out of our park. This is no place for free speech. When did we put them back up? I can't remember, but I'll tell you why we did. It's because the rich are robbing us. That's right. We're thin because the parade is fat. Shut up, you sick downer bastard. Black dog, wet blanket. They're eating our bread. They're eating our butter. And they've locked us out so we won't see. That's why you need a letter of transit. You're trying to bring us down, you rotten downer. Wet blanket. Well, it's time to tear down those gates. Tear down these fences! We'll have none of that anarcho-syndicalist trash, thank you. He's actually <laughs> telling the truth. <laughs> part of it. <laughs> That's what you get for telling the truth around here, poor sod. <laughs> well, that was dark. Odd. Why are there peepers patrolling the park? I should snoop around a bit. Earl of Sandwich Park. Well, I'll have to go there later, if I can. For now, I gotta get to this place.
Uh, hello, I'm attempting to locate Dr. Faraday. Uh, can you tell me where I can find him? I'm afraid that information is not for public consumption, sir. I can tell him where to find Bobby Hickenbotham, though. Oh, for heaven's sake. He's not at a reform club again, is he? He was supposed to go to Lud's own. Well, apparently he feels so guilty that Dr. F has been deprived of the liberties, which are the birthright of every English citizen, he's gonna get his arse spanked. Constable Bevan, I'm not the public. I'm from the Department of Archives, Printing and Recycling. We're conducting an investigation into Dr. Faraday's handling of municipal records relating to the maintenance of the inter-insular bridges. Two requests have already been sent by Miss Bing to your superior requesting this information. If I have to go back to the parade, Miss Bing's next letter regarding this apparently deliberate festinence will include the name of the last person I talked to. Will that be you, Constable, or the chap who keeps the constabulary's address book? In that case, sir, why don't you take the elevator on up to records? They'll sort you out. Thank you. I shall. What the hell is festinence? They deprived Dr. Faraday of his liberties, but he made all the bridges. Is this the elevator? Yes. Percival Hastings, is it not? N no, it's Arthur. Percival went away. Odd. There are some things you think you'll never forget. But then I suppose you do. I'm Arthur. Arthur Hastings. Memories play tricks on you, do they not? What the heck? Hello? Constable Bevan said you're the chap who has Dr. Faraday's current address. Uh, uh, that's right. I I've got records of everyone's address back there. All alphabetical. I'm quite proud of it. So, where is Dr. Faraday relocated to? Oh, uh, I can't tell you that. You're not a constable. <laughs> I guess it would take two of you to make one constable, if you had platform shoes. <laughs> right. Anyone else you'd like me to not tell you the address of? You're very helpful. That's what everyone says. You know, I used to patrol the street. It was lovely. Shopkeepers give you sandwiches, ladies flirt, the warm sun on your coat. One misstep, and they put you in the records room. It's hardly fair. He was breathing when I left him. Where do you think you're going then? Now, I gotta figure out what to do here. an electric thing. Did I not pick it up? I might not have, but there's a vent here. So let's try this vent and see where it goes. This is kind of creepy. If they're alphabetical, maybe I can find Dr. F's address myself. F for Faraday. Is a lock pick. Well, I don't think I have a lock pick. Hey! 
Hey! What are you doing now? We've got a downer here, haven't we? You can't hide from me! Oh god, this place is weird. Nothing Don't here. Me. Just having a bit of a sit that I can use for a, really. Why is there never? You might want to see a doctor, sir. You're only making it harder on yourself. Oof. Police brutality. That's the last time you Oof. Oh well. Well everybody, I'm gonna end the stream there right now because I'm kinda tired. But that was the first little bit of We Happy Few. I'm going to keep on streaming this game probably until I beat it. Well, that feels entirely too good. <laughs> I'm going to keep on playing this game until I beat it. And I'll only play this game on stream so we don't miss anything. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it today. And uh, thanks for coming out for everyone who commented in chat. I'll see you guys next time. And once again, thanks for watching.